is a layer of free nice music guys and you can choose it for free on your own and you can use it on your video it is free only and don't worry it will not copyright on your video <laughs> video again for today's video guys i will gonna share you some tutorial on how to use free music on your youtube video so guys this application is called the dropbox from youtube to dropbox so if you don't have this application you can download it from your apple store or your android store um always think guys that do not use copyright music in youtube videos because this content is not our so I recommend that to use the no copyright music. This is how guys I will show you. There is a layer of free nice music guys and you can choose it for free on your own and you can use it on your video. It is free only and don't worry it will not copyright on your video. The search, I will go now to my YouTube guys. I will search blog no copyright music I have subscribed this guys because I am sure that this music here are free and I am using this also for almost a year so let's see for example I will use the music um, you can search or you can find here guys whatever you want for example, this one, Memories. So, I will click here and then copy the link, guys. Then, we will go to Converter. Uh, YouTube Video Converter. The Ymate.com. This is the one I'm using, guys. So, just paste the link here okay then there it is and then the file size is 7.5 guys you choose 7.5 because I'm using 7.5 and then click download again if the link will bring you any site don't open that guys just go back to the winemate.com and then click again download it's already running here so before you will use this guys be sure you have downloaded the dropbox application because dropbox application can accept a heavy file so you can save your file all there even how many music you will save there that's why I recommended you to download Dropbox for me I'm using Dropbox for almost five years now because I'm editing some videos and I'm saving there also and before I am downloading movies I am saving in my Dropbox so it's already done guys let's click this one so I will maybe this is the one memories yes so there it is so I will gonna click this file transfer I will transfer it to Dropbox Wait, Dropbox. So this is the one. Choose a folder. So it's already there. I will gonna save the file. And let me check guys so it's already running uploading file
so as you can see i have a lot of music here guys that i'm using for my uh, videos don't worry guys this is not copyrighted content or music this is free so i have already here now this is the one it's ready guys so let's go for my editing video so I'm using iMovie so for example I will gonna use the music in my video I will go this edit option then um, the my movie one so let's go back let's go back to Dropbox I will click these three dots on the left right corner and then export so go to more and export to iMovie this one so you can click here more if you want to audio only because this music so I need to click audio only if you also if you want also to insert is as a video guys or clips so you can do it no need to click the audio you can click it directly so for me i will use only audio because i want only a music so this is it and then it's already here guys you can move this one some music guys only three minutes so for me I will gonna move this one from the purse so that it will be fit and the entire video has a music so it's already here so you can move this one guys from the first There are some music guys, only 3 minutes, so you can add more music if you want. But there is also some music you can only slide this one and then you can add like this. So this one it cannot add more, so until here only. So it's here already guys. So this one, I will need more to move it. So you can move this one, guys, until from the start, so that from the start of your video has a music. So let's say, for example, here. So we have now already my best background. to speak in English, guys. Even I'm not perfect in English, I hope so. You can adjust the volume here. It depends on you what editor app using on your video, guys. So for me, I'm using this iMovie, so it's easy for me to edit my video. And then just click done. Then already done. So it's done that you can already transfer your edited video on your gallery or on your file guys so and that's it all for today guys i hope you learned something in this video and i will see you on my next video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and guys don't forget to open the description box down below i put the link uh, on the music where you can easily find it the vlog no copyright music that's a channel guys of vlog no copyright music so always think guys that this music here is free no worries at all because i'm also using this for almost a year so thank you for watching bye bye